Impact. Hey, what's up guys? It's Coach Dan here for your Recovery Friday video. We're going to continue the theme of the week and talk all things detox today. So, oh, speak of Mr. Detox himself, Dylan Russell right here. He can really benefit from this info I'm about to tell you guys. Have a good workout, Dylan. Uh, anyways, guys, so <laughs> detox. Let's talk about the top five ways we can detox. So we're all starting off the new year. We're trying to get everything back in the swing of things, trying to get back on track with our workouts, with our nutrition. And then we also got these Seahawks games on the weekend where everybody's probably smashing some shitty food, smashing some stuff that we shouldn't be doing. Hey, Leanne. Hey. <laughs> and so I'm going to give you guys the top five ways here to detox, all right? Way number one is too fast, right? So let's say we were watching the Seahawks game, we smashed on some chips and some dip and some pizza and all that stuff that we should not have ate. The best way to recover from that the next day is to go through a little bit of a fast, about 14 to 16 hours or so. So from our last meal at night to our first meal in the morning, 14 to 16 hours, generally we're just gonna skip breakfast, start to eat at like one or two in the morning. And then that leads to the next step is we wanna break that fast with some greens. So we wanna get a nice solid greens drink in, and then the rest of the day we're eating clean, we're eating that good all natural, real food and staying to our diet plan. Um, number three is we wanna sweat. So we gotta make sure we sweat it out. Um, whether it's coming in here for a boot camp, whether it's doing a boot camp workout on your own, we gotta sweat it out, guys. And then the next one is we gotta make sure we don't let it snowball. A lot of times when people get off track and they get off track for the long term, is they have one bad day and they're just like, oh shit, I had a bad day, I'm just gonna keep letting this go. And then, you know, one bad day leads to another, leads to another, right? And we get off track and that weight starts to pile on. So look at it from a growth mindset perspective, from the fact that, yeah, we messed up, we had a bad cheat day, but now we're gonna get back right on track the next day, right? And another one, um, last thing is just to supplement some branch chains in, some branch chains and some glutamine. Um, so get on your subs and then also stay hydrated. Make sure that we're pounding at least like 80 to 100 ounces of water that day, really flushing all that shitty stuff out of our system. So um, if you guys have any questions, hit me up, Dan at Go Impact Strength. But again, guys, action items this week, make sure we hit this detox plan um, after the cheat day, after the game. Uh, whenever we need it. All right, so use these tools. Hit me up if you have any questions. Dan at Go Impact Strength. Thanks guys.